Hello everybody, this is Ruler of Ice and welcome back to Let's Play Skyrim. Now I'm going to continue where I left of last time, so let's get down to it. And as I said last time, I'm going to tackle the Silver Fall Mine. And uh, before I actually started recording, I went back to... Back to Riverwood and actually stocked up on uh, potions there. And also clean my inventory. So without further ado, let's go inside. Also my throat is again sore. So sorry if I cough. I also hope that you guys can see properly here. This place is quite dark. There are a lot of white caps here. Whoa! Actually, forgot about that one. And I also leveled up, by the way. As I went further into the mine, the ground under my feet suddenly broke. How do I get out of here? That's a good question. A very good question. I actually should do a little alchemy here. It doesn't matter if I'm drenched, I'm going to dry up soon here. That sent shivers down my spine. <laughs> On my way through the mine, I suddenly heard a very strange sound. This must probably be the noise, which is reported elsewhere, everywhere. I should be careful. English is not strong in this one. I don't mind, though. Some unread books, so I'm going to read and take them. You're probably wondering, how is this difficult, as I said in the last episode. There are no enemies around. Oh, give it time. Give it time. I can't move. Again, shivers. Uh, I'm just gonna take them. Oh, and dagger? Wait, that was a... Oh, scorching. Okay, nice. I don't trust this.
again that noise. This is pretty uncomfortable down here. The strange light seems to come from even further down. As it stands, I have no choice but to jump into the hole. It is the only way. <sighs> I guess it is so. And there's a stream here. So strong that it... I'm not pushing forward. There we go. Dips. <laughs> Lone hallway. This is not good. Hi. Oh. Oh, hello. You should already tell by this that this is going to be difficult. Undead worker is not dying as fast as it should. Also, the damage it made came me. Ancient no. You're not giving me anything here. I really don't know if I can do this with two handed build. I did this with archery. And even then, it was very difficult. I died many times. You don't believe me? Wait until the end. Report of the events in the mine, and half attended each shaft. Today, everything is calm. Encountered in each shaft a huge, on a huge load. Promises a good yield. More workers have ordered. Expanding further into the east shaft, minor problems with friable rock. Otherwise, everything is quiet. Came across a water course. Two men were torn into the deep by a jet of water. The authorities have ordered the closure of the mine. Just for that reason? Why? It was an accident. You don't close a mine because of that. Something is wrong. The man at has a tourney. What does that mean? Some even have not finished a meal. That's never happened before. It is among us. Somewhere in the depths of the mine. It talks to us. I don't know where it came from. Or what it actually is. But it controls us. I gotta get out. Or I'm going crazy. Or am I already? Again, English is not strong in this one. Oh! I'm not going to level up, actually. I'm going to save it. Well, that was a dead body on a stake. Ugh, don't do that. Yeah, they're doing a lot of damage, just these skeletons, which is a sign that th I'm underleveled here. I keep wondering why this is said to be so that you have to be level 15 at minimum. I don't think 
This build I have is meant for that. Meant to be done in level 15, but level 25. If you're a tank, then maybe, maybe, then, this can be done at level 15. Other than that, no. What's happening? Oh no 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 no, don't do this trick on me. Yep. Yep. Oh. Blood on the wall. And a mannequin. A lot a living mannequin. Oh no. And you're stuck. Or not. Oh, finally a door that works. And it works too well. What is going on here? Foremost, this room, and now... Is this real, or am I going crazy? Uh, usually when, when it comes to these things, it's a it's Daedra thing. But is it a Daedra? This does look like a pocket dimension. Old house. Wait a minute, wasn't the house much smaller? And why doesn't it fit the interior to what I've seen outside at all? It's bigger on the inside than it is on the outside. Why does this one have... Oh, oh, execution hood. <coughs> Sorry. It seems this man was executed. Anything in here? Oh, leather strips. Oh, thank you. I'll take that. Automatic doors. I didn't click on that. What? These books are on steel? Really? I'll go up. Jesus! That's not a wardrobe. Oh, hi. Hi. I should have drunk something. Oh, chest. You don't do this. Yep, you're making me chase it.
Oh, now you gave me. Ebony boots. You're giving me ebony boots. The second best armor in this game. In case you're wondering, the best armor is Daedric armor. And it's very, very rare in this game. There's only one piece of each armor. In the entire game, there are no copies. Only one set. I'm taking this. And then this, and... Ooh! This. Not sure... It was a trap. Since I have the key, it goes here, probably. Oh, my voice is going. Oh, what's wrong with this rule? I found the diary of Half, but why is it here in this house? In his diary, Half suspected that everything here is not real. It just sit, it just exists in our minds, and a power which is called the Stone of Chaos controls our sense. So this is the reason why the workers had such a strange behavior, and the mind was closed so suddenly. Half also shares his thoughts of how to destroy the Stone of Chaos. He says that you can fight it in your own head. But how? Finally, all this is not real. <coughs> it is here, among us, in us. It controls our thoughts and our actions. It guides us like a puppeteer who holds all the reins. It lets us see things that are not true. It makes us feel things that are not real. We are prisoners of its power. We are slaves for eternity. Beyond death. I've often wondered how one could destroy it. Come from its power freely. But I dropped that idea quickly. Because how can someone destroy something that is not real? Only exists in our minds. But if it is not real, how can it control us then? No matter how I racked my brain, I only came to one solution. It can only be destroyed there, where his power is at its greatest. In your own head. In other words, sleep. In your dreams. But I have a little hope. Eventually one may come to save us all, and he will destroy the stunned chaos. Forever. Maybe. Wait a minute. This bed. Yes, I have an idea. If this was not real, what could happen when I'm sleeping in this surrealism or dream? I do not know, but I have only one option. I need to try it, even if I feel no fatigue here. If I do not, I'm just like everyone else, locked here forever. Uh, before I do, this is where the difficulty really spikes up. Uh, first, this? I only have one minute, that's not good. Should have probably drank it. Later. Oh well. Health increased by 100 points. Oh, I could drink this one. Uh, appears spectral for 30 seconds. That's not helpful, really. I don't know how to use scrolls. Never did actually learn how to use scrolls. <sighs> I'll actually do this. Um, I'll put ebony boots on. Because I am going to need a lot of protection here. As much protection as I can. Probably should have made a better armor. Quick save. Here goes.
Oh, there's no floor here. Quite colorful. I have to destroy these quickly. Because of these. You see what I mean by difficulty? Yet, health. And, uh, two handed. Is there anything here? Devastating bow, standing power attacks to 25% damage. This. Wow, that did a lot of damage to me. Oh, that was regenerate. This is not going well at all. Boss has a beard. No, don't run away. Oh, there's no magic. I have no magic. Ah. Uh. Yeah, this is what I mean by difficulty. I should have stuck up um, more potions. Way more potions. If necessary, I will use the SF SFP mod and actually level myself up. They do they appear too fast and they do a lot of damage. This is why I didn't want to do this so fast. Because I knew this was going to be nightmare. Even these skeletons do a lot of damage to me. And now, before they appear, I should have actually stuck up on that uh, stamina potions too. Can't really do anything else here. safe. This is my best bet because I am standing still here. I have to drink potions every time my health goes halfway. 
That's how I must do this. Two down. One more to go. And potions. And sleeping tree sap. Yes. Perfect. Oh, there's one more. There's one more. That boss that's very annoying. Frost attack. Saving. I'm not going to do this again. I'm getting cold here too. Actually, restore magic on. would do this. If I go straight up, I'm going to die. At least the Atronox are out of the way. Now it's just this. The ghost of the stone... The chaos. Let's go! Health... I'm going to die. Oh, I did it. Oh, quickly remains there. Can collect as many as I can. Oh God, I did it. Yes, I did it. It worked. The stone of chaos is destroyed and can no longer wield power on the people. The mine is buried. It will probably remain forever a mystery where it came from and why it appeared just at the mine. So it wasn't probably a, a day trick thing going on there. Something else. And the door is buried. Oh. Oh. Save. Oh. Oh. I knew it was going to be hard. I knew it. I should have been level 25 at minimum. Probably. And I didn't even need to use SXP mod. Oh. Oh. That's it then. That's it then. What's next? Um This one's uh, this one is in the north near Solstheim, I believe. Uh, there we go. Yeah, there. Way up north. Nowhere near Soli 2. And I said Solstan. That's not. <laughs> that's not. <the laughs> I meant to say Solitude. 
And even then, it's way over there. Way too far. And On Guard is in the east. I'm not going to do that, or Dragonborn, or the Horn of Jurgen Windcaller. Ugh. Now this one is also in north. Delayed burial, that's also not a quest I would like to do, so what's left? The blessing of nature. And in my time of need, those two. Or I could go to Falkreath. One of those three I could do. I should stop. <sighs> oh man. I did say that this was going to be difficult and I meant it. It's the beginning that's easy. Very easy. This was meant to be a horror mod. <sighs> so, I'll actually... There are two quests that I could do. And one of them is an escort mission. One that I... W one that will be quite hard. I would actually like to get it out of the way. And it's this. The blessing of nature. I will do this. To White Run then. That's my goal in the next episode then. Wow, I can't believe actually that I did it. In two-handed build, it was difficult. It was very difficult. As I guessed. So, thank you so much for watching this video. Leave a like if you enjoyed. And subscribe to my channel for more videos, and check out my previous Let's Play videos if you haven't already, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye bye, I'm getting cold. I should probably head to Riverwood first, and warm myself up. It's not far from here. Yeah, bye bye.